Every decade, legends are born whose achievements remain unprecedented. The last 10 years have been no exception. During this period, new outstanding wrestlers have emerged who have managed to achieve such impressive results that it will be either very difficult or almost impossible for the next generation of wrestlers to repeat the same thing. I would like to present to your attention a magnificent trio of wrestlers who have succeeded in all international competitions, and not just once, but many times, becoming absolute legends of world wrestling this decade. Abdul Rashid Sejalayev is without a doubt the most dominant freestyle wrestler in the world from 2010 to 2019. In 2019 Sejalayev was only 24 years old, but even then he had four gold medals in his collection of world championships. He won gold at the 2014, 2015, 2018 and 2019 World Championships and won silver in 2017. In addition, Sejalev also won an Olympic gold medal in Rio in the 86kg weight category, making him one of the strongest freestyle wrestlers in the world this decade. Just imagine that by the time Sejalev retires, he could be the most successful freestyle wrestler in the world ever. Jordan Burroughs is an American freestyle wrestling legend. For the past decade, he has ruled in a 74kg weight class like no one else before him. Like Sejalev, Burroughs has won four world champion gold medals as well as three bronze medals. Like the Russian, he also has Olympic gold. Although he won his last Olympic medal in 2012, Burroughs may be past his peak, but whatever the future holds for Burroughs, his accomplishments over the past decade put him among the best wrestlers the wrestling world has ever seen. Mikein Lopez is the heavyweight king of Greco-Roman wrestling. The Greco-Roman world has seen many legends in the past. If Alexander Karolin was a legend of the previous decade, this decade his title has been passed on to Mikein Lopez of Cuba. Lopez has won everything there is to win. He won World Championship gold five times, two of those five gold medals in that decade in 2010 at the World Championships in Moscow, and in 2014 in Tashkent. But his greatest performances came at the most important milestones of the decade, the Olympics. As in 2008, he was again the leader in the super heavyweight category, winning gold medals in 2012 in London and 2016 in Rio de Janeiro. After that, he accomplished a feat no other wrestler has ever achieved, winning his fourth Olympic gold medal. But that's the subject of another video.